a Carnegie Institution for Science audio press release for November 29, 2011. Surprise Role of Nuclear Structure Protein in Development Scientists have long held theories about the importance of proteins called B-type lamins in the process of embryonic stem cells replicating and differentiating into different varieties of cells. New research from a team led by Carnegie's Zhang Jing indicates that counter to expectations, these B-type lamins are not necessary for stem cells to renew and develop, but are necessary for proper organ development. B-type lamins are part of a family of proteins that compose the nuclear lamina, which is the material that lines the inside of a cell's nucleus. They are thought to be essential for a cell's survival. Mutations in lamins have been linked to a number of human diseases. Lamins are thought to suppress the expression of certain genes by binding directly to the DNA within the cell's nucleus. The ability of B-type lamins to use DNA binding suppression was thought to be crucial for telling a cell which development pathway to follow. Thus, these lamins were believed to be crucial to the differentiation of embryonic stem cells into various types of cells, depending on their location within the body. Contrary to expectations, they found that B-type laminas were not essential for embryonic stem cells to survive nor did their DNA binding directly regulate the genes to which they were attached. However, mice deficient in B-type lamins were born with improperly developed organs, including defects in the lungs, diaphragms, and brains, and were unable to breathe. The work seems to indicate that B-type lamins are not part of the early developmental tissue-building process, but they are important in facilitating the integration of different cell types into the complex architectures of various developing organs. The Carnegie Institution has had over 100 years of extraordinary discoveries. To continue this tradition, Carnegie scientists need your support. For more information about this and other cool science, visit our website at carnegiescience.edu. This is John Strom.